His music videos have gone viral, racking up millions of views, but Brian Thompson's performing days go back to his years at IPS. WRTV's Rafael Sanchez introduces us to the hometown music man with the keys to success. Brian Thompson can scale any musical challenge. He makes it look easy. I think what people are seeing that's easy is the passion, the, the enjoyment. That's what people see that, but that's always easy because that's just innate, it's natural. What they don't see is the late nights, the, these long rehearsals. He received his first saxophone at nine years old, taking lessons for six months and then letting his gift do the rest. When I was like, uh, there's this video, when I was like, uh, I think I was nine, 10, or 10 years old and I played The Way We Were. And I just couldn't listen to the song until I learned it. Take notes. Brian doesn't need sheet music. He hears it and plays it, despite the hearing loss in his right ear. I went to eighth grade band at school for 143 in the Bronx. I had the mm. baritone sax. This is me. Ha, 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 oh. That's all I could do with my baritone sax. You pick this up, and I'm hearing angels. You know, so, I mean, it's, it's I sounded that way. That's how I sounded when I began. When? I when? When, that, when, that, I, when I started, no. I, I honestly just got to a point where I'm comfortable listening to myself. Maybe as of the past three years, I can listen to myself play now. Before I couldn't, because I didn't like how I sounded. The Broad Ripple High School graduate took a break from the IU Jacobs School of Music. Hey, a little bit of the new one, the Bossa Real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And moved to Los Angeles, where he's met elite performers. Kenny G's signature somewhere on here. He's also connected with indie native Babyface, as well as Tony Braxton, and performed with R&B singer Her during the Academy Awards in 2021. That was great. You gotta look back at what you've done. Okay. You gotta sometimes take a look in the rearview mirror just to see, like, that's where I've been. That's what, that you know, wow, I actually did do that. Sometimes what you've done is also just as important while you're continuing to create new things to do. Not to get complacent after visiting memory lane, but to be motivated after visiting memory lane. Being back home again allows him to reconnect, recharge, and reveal what really matters. Every time I come back, you're coming home to your family. Working for you in Indianapolis, Rafael Sanchez, WRTV. And he is so talented. Well, the 25-year-old recently released a new album. He's been working on it since 2017. It's called B. Thompson POV. He'll be performing selections at the Jazz Kitchen this Friday at 7 and Saturday at 7 and at 10.